imagine a public art installation that's not just created by an independent artist, but is created by the very people who make up your community. Like this, for example, Umbala. This is a giant interactive playground and collective art installation that was created by Misfits Unified during one of our free collective art festivals. What is a public art festival? It is an event run by Misfits Unified where the vision, the inspiration, the hearts and the souls of your community are captured and we create a truly cohesive and impressive public artwork for your community. Really. I feel like it's a child and I feel a lot of power also that we can create this together. <laughs> Enjoy all the colors. Yeah. <laughs> it's not just about creating a piece of public artwork, it's much more than that. It's about what it means to everybody involved. For example, we show people to reconnect with their creativity and we show them to push themselves beyond what they believe is capable. For example, this guy, created by people who haven't really taken art before, uh, and what they felt, the pride and the glory they felt by being part of this creation, is much more powerful than the creation itself. How do you feel about him? Emotional. So good. So, so, so good. So happy. So super proud. I never sculpted before, so I didn't really know how I would uh, how I would perform here but then actually especially like the second coating when it comes to like the final to work out the details and I surprised myself so much because I was really good at it and I just like started with a little gnome face and suddenly that guy was looking at me and I was like wow that's actually easy to do once you once you dare doing it and so yeah that was that was great I think yeah this, these are really the cool moments in life when you surprise yourself with something that you didn't know you can do so yeah that was great over the years, through all of our experimentation, not only do we have ways of getting everybody to, to agree and unify their vision into one common goal, irrespective of what kind of people, what kind of backgrounds they are, but we have ways of teaching and working with people so that anybody can get involved. I think the last time I held the paintbrush, I was probably 12 or 13 years old when I held the paintbrush. And, um, and here I am, you know, fully fledged. In Mbala, when people don't have the same idea um, together, you learn to say, okay, we don't agree on this one, okay, we can put it aside. Let's find where we agree. If you don't agree, it's fine. It's fine to disagree, but don't let it block your creative process. This is what we're learning as a human species, that we can work together. I painted me as a little girl um, and I had actually never painted before. What other form of public art is more compelling for your community other than something that they've created for themselves? This is the symbol of a new age, I feel. The creative golden age. Yeah, where art is used to bring people together and create and show that we are able to recreate the world and the new dreams for the generation to come. You know, if we stay together and we work together with the same goal, with the positive attitude, with the good leadership, good ideas, everything is possible. So, kind of trust and hope for the humanity actually, to be able to overcome any obstacles with our creative minds. <laughs>